yourself a merry little situation like it was like a beautiful scene from a book or a beautiful scene from a movie. It definitely sounds very cheesy but what I realized now looking back at when I was the happiest in my life, when I was the most content, when I was really just like beaming of joy and good energy was when I had that attitude and whenever in my life when I've been in a rut, when I've been anxious, depressed has been when I forgot about that attitude and the reason for this I think is whenever I cook a meal I like candles I put a nice music and I make kind of like a thing out of it or when I walk with my dogs instead of taking the same route every day I try to find like new paths to walk just setting myself up for having these beautiful experiences waking up really early so I can see the sunset or going to bed late so I can see the stars and another light. When you do that, when you try to kind of make these magical moments in the everyday life, it kind of brings you back to the present moment. And that is kind of the key behind it and the secret behind it, why that makes you more happy than if you were to just always pushing forward, being anxious about where you want to be or being depressed. Just romanticizing the past instead of trying to romanticize the present moment that you're in. And the beautiful thing about it is not that you have these huge expectations about the day. It's not like you're waiting for something to come to you. You are making each moment beautiful. And that is the little things like lighting candles, music, putting on a comfy outfit, making a good dinner, meeting new people, talking to strangers, having these beautiful conversations with your friends and family, discovering new areas in your neighborhood. Just as little as when I go to the store, instead of kind of reaching for the same juice or the same drink that I usually go for, to try something new and exciting and not drinking it out of the bottle, but drinking it from like a wine glass or a champagne glass. Kind of putting that cherry on top of every of these small moments. And I think that is the secret behind me enjoying my days. And whenever I'm not enjoying my days, it's because I forget that. Because I'm so anxious to kind of accomplish something. Or I'm not where I want to be. Or basically whenever I'm like pushing for the future or going back to my past. Obviously you can do that for a short amount of time but in the long run that is not gonna make you happy. So that is the thought of the day and that is what I'm gonna focus on this weekend to really just sprinkle everything with a little bit of fairy dust. Yeah, enjoy the little things. Saturday evening we're about to get a couple of visitors because we're gonna have game night which is one of my favorite things to do. I love quizzes and question games not that I'm really good at it, but I just, I love to learn while it's a competition, if that makes sense. I might just put on some makeup. Hey. Oh. Is that Marley saying I'm beautiful without makeup? Just need to hug. Oh, I love you too. Uh, we'll see. Maybe without makeup then. In this house, the office is just rolling in the background 24-7. Oh, I haven't shown you this yet. So a friend of mine, an artist, I'll leave his link down below. He did this. So my brother bought this second hand. It used to be on the ship. Super kind of Pirates of the Caribbean-ish. And then we had him do his kind of famous fish symbol on it. And here's... Lofoten, the map of Lofoten inside the fish. Super dope.
happy Sunday. We are on a road trip, my brother and I, and right now we're just picking up a table that he bought second hand, and then we're gonna head to Henningsvad, where it's a little Christmas market, which I'm very excited about. So, yeah, that's what we're up to today. First kind of sprinkle of Christmas, or the first kind of Christmas activity. That's a lie, because I have been wrapping presents and stuff like that, but kind of official with other people. Uh, but of course we're going to be careful uh, because of the coronavirus and everything, so we're going to keep distance and um, all of that. about three o'clock and it's already getting dark the sun has set so we're just gonna try to find some hot chocolate or glug and uh, then drive home I think the wonders of life got the prettiest side for everyone to enjoy Standing up close by the Christmas tree, glimmering light. I am right where I'm. Okay, we just ordered porridge. This is a vegan one, and this is the non-vegan one. And it's topped with whoa! It smells so good, like burnt almonds. I don't know what this is. Some apple and stuff. Be home for a couple of days, wander around with you. You and me in the cold, thought it never be true. Wherever I go, I got you. Oh, I have stopped running, there is no way trying. You better lose. 